Uh, my name is Justin Frischberg. I'm chairman of London Wheelchair Rugby Club. I was injured playing rugby, broke my neck uh, 20 years ago now. Well, the, the research report was quite distressing. It showed a that too many people with spinal cord injuries are going into inappropriate housing, and um, you know the one thing that I've realised, you know, being 20 years in a chair, is that you need the example of others and your 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 peers, other young people that have got on with their lives. And if you're in a nursing home, you know your expectations are going to be reinforced that you, you have no life and. It's very distressing that people are getting depressed and pressure sores is something that we shouldn't be having in this country. So, um, yeah, it's very worrying. Um, I mean, I was quite fortunate when uh, I, was, I got out of St. Mandeville Hospital and they were good to me and my parents were able to adapt the house and I went straight into you know, appropriate housing, became a student again and, and got on with my life. And, um, if I think my parents hadn't been able to do that and I'd been stuck in a nursing home, that would have been, you know, very depressing. It's a very, very difficult stage of life anyway when you've had a traumatic injury. And to put on somebody that sort of environment um, where they're almost forgotten about, um, you know, that's inevitably going to lead to all these problems. Well, we've just had the Paralympics and, you know, we, we celebrated Dr. Goodman who founded Step Mandeville and the, and the Paralympic movement and yet here we are sort of 60 years on uh, and people are going into really inappropriate housing. Goodman would not have allowed this. Goodman would not have allowed people to to rot and get depressed and you know if they're dying that's something that we shouldn't be accepting and especially with 2012 we've got to hope for a better reality.